Hey everyone, so I just wanted to show you guys um, how I put on makeup. So I'm going to start with primer. This is Prime Time by Bare Essentials. Bare Minerals, Bare Essentials. Um, and I'm just focusing, focusing it on the areas that um, I like the foundation to stick more or the BB cream to stick more. And that is my um, eyes and I'm putting it on my lips in case I want to put on lipstick and just like where any blemishes are so the BB cream like sticks better and um, to reduce oil so now I'm going to put on my BB cream in medium the Smashbox, ca Smashbox camera ready um, that I talk to you guys about all the time and I just kind of work it into my fingers and I start where the blemishes are and I like to focus most of it um, in blemished areas and on my under eyes I'm just kind of working it in now um, it's just to make it easier for when I use a brush to blend it in as you guys can see um, so I'm putting it on my nose um, and just kind of focusing on the crevices as I um, brush use a forever 21 foundation brush to kind of smooth it out now I'm setting it with um, the D slick smash box I mean D slick urban decay um, translucent powder compressed powder I guess and now I'm using the D slick finishing spray before I put on the um, blush and the bronzer just to make sure I'm controlling for oil and I just use three sprays to let it set in a little um, and now I'm using a Rimmel London I think it's called like summer sand or something palette I guess it's a palette it's um, a little set of four eyeshadows and I'm using that color to um, just put all over my lid um, and I use the lighter color for my eyebrows um, which you see right now and I just kind of blend it in with my fingers to make it look more natural since it's a very shimmery color um, and now I'm using the Tarte Amazonian Clay Bronzer that they have and a Clinique blending brush, um, which obviously isn't used for this, but I think it helps me apply the bronzer better. Um, and I'm using it to contour my face. As you can see, I'm focusing on the areas closer to my ears and then I'm dragging it out towards my mouth um, and to cover the rest of my jawline. Um, but I'm focusing it most by my ear, kind of, just to um, make my face look a little slimmer. I don't really put it on my nose that much anymore because I don't really think it does anything, to be honest. Um, so, yeah, you can see me working it in. And now I'm using the, um, oh, yeah, the clay, the Amazonian clay was from Tarte. This is from Tarte as well. It's in the color Doll Face. It's just a blush. And as you can see, I'm not focusing that much on the apples of my cheeks, but on the side because I feel like it fits my face better. Now I'm using Amethyst um, Lip Gloss from Lorac in this little CD case that I, it's called a CD Greatest Hits from them. And now I'm using the MAC Zoom Lash, which I don't really like that mascara that much, but I paid more for it and um, it gets the job done, so I'm just trying to get rid of it. <laughs> um, but I do like the L'Oreal Vol Voluminous Mascara better. Um, and now I'm just kind of getting ready by um, putting on earrings and a pearl bracelet and this little hair tie um, and now I'm about to start focusing on my hair so I take my hair out because it was clipped up to put on the makeup and I'm kinda um, I had a clip to tie it to twist it on the side and now I'm combing it out and I'll probably put another twist in it um, and I'm just kinda working it out with my fingers so I don't pull out too much hair when I use this brush which is a Rimmel brush or a Remington brush so I hope you guys enjoyed this video and this simple natural look. 